Hi guys, my name is Anthony Beckett. Some of you guys are first time runners and have never done an event before. A lot of people have asked me how I get my bibs on so straight and how is it done with event clips. Well this short video will go through everything you should do pre-race to make yourself not look like this but like a real elite runner. First of all, the event pack. So you'll get a pack like this, and in it will include a few things. Let's have a look what we've got here. So we've got the bib. It has a critical component called a gear tag, or a luggage tag, or a bag tag. Do not run with this. The first thing you should do is either throw it straight in the bin, or attach it to your bag. This is not to be run with, because if you do, people will think you're an amateur. Secondly, you get some stuff, and then you get these things. I really don't know what they're for. So, event clips. So event clips come a little bag, and simply they are just round press studs that you need to separate the backing piece from. So what we'll do is separate these. And for those who don't know the benefits of event clips, basically you can wear your bib, get it perfectly set up, and uh, the other benefit is you don't destroy your clothes. So the first thing you do is you grab your running shirt and you lay it flat on the bench. Then what you need to do, grab your bib, place it roughly two inches beneath the Packet and Roadrunners logo, should you be wearing it, and uh, slip your press studs in behind the back. What you need to do is you need to get the first one located first, just so you can get the proper regulation gap, and then just grab the top piece and push it through like so. Once you've got that right, you can continue working around the bib. Getting the first two is essential because once you get the angle wrong, you just muck up the rest of the bib. Yeah. You'll notice that on a event clip you can have a logo, in mine you have the Packingham Roadrunners logo, and what you should do is always rotate the event clip so that you can see the logo in the upright position. The last thing you want to do is be on a run and someone make a comment to you while you're running which might discourage you and you might not get that ever elusive PB. And there you go, see? There you go. A perfect bib layout. Hope you've enjoyed the video.